Bushfires in Australia are a widespread and regular occurrence that have contributed significantly to shaping the nature of the continent over millions of years. Eastern Australia is one of the most fire-prone regions of the world, and its predominant eucalyptus forests have evolved to thrive on the phenomenon of bushfire. However the fires can cause significant property damage and loss of both human and animal life. The 2019-20 Australian bushfire season, colloquially known as Black Summer, was a period of unusually intense bushfires in many parts of Australia. The 2019-20 bushfires in New South Wales, NSW, have been unprecedented in their extent and intensity. As of February 3, 2020, the fire ground in NSW covers 5.4 million hectares. 7% of the state, including 2.7 million hectares in national parks, 37% of the NSW park system. The fire have killed as many as 500 million animals so far continues into the new year as the Royal Australian Navy, RAN, and the Royal Australian Air Force, RAAF, are deployed to New South Wales to assist mass evacuation efforts. In addition to the ongoing logistical and engineering support from the Australian Defence Force ADF, a historical precedent was set on January 4, 2020 when the Prime Minister, the Minister for Defence, and the Minister for Water Resources, Drought, Rural Finance, Natural Disaster and Emergency announced the compulsory call-out of Australian Defence Force Reserve Brigades for the first time in the country's history involving the deployment of up to 3,000 reservists. It was also announced that one of the Royal Australian Navy's two largest ships, Ms Adelaide, would join two other Navy vessels in preparation for the evacuation of people from fire-affected areas along the coast, and that an additional three Chinook helicopters and six other aircraft would also be deployed.